Welcome back everyone, Rick's Gadgets here. Uh, today I wanted to do a kind of an impromptu video on my uh, Prusa MK3 printer. Uh, I've had it for almost a year now and done a lot of prints on it. Uh, but recently we started getting an error. It was uh, the fan error and it would stop printing. It would show up on the display down here. So I searched around on the internet, uh, found a couple of articles. But I did have, I uh, found one video, and I'll link the video in the description below of a gentleman. He did a pretty good job of explaining it. And come to find out, it has to deal with this hard point back here on the back. Um, as you can see, there's a hard point that's zip tied. And then the wires come off of that. And you can see how they move here. And what happens is, after many hours of moving back and forth. The wires kind of get brittle and break inside the housing. And then usually what happens is when the head moves to the far position, uh, it, it cuts the fan off. And when that happens, it kills the whole print. Um, but mine was a little different. Um, I was kind of trying to troubleshoot it. I would turn the fan on. I would go back here. I would wiggle the wires all different directions. Nothing would happen. Um, and so here's the video. What I did was I unwrapped all the wrapping off the back and I exposed the the wires for the fan and the fan on this one is the three wires. They call it servo wire. Um, but as you can see, I'm going to insert a, a video. Sorry for the, the bad quality, but you can see I'll move the wires, twist them back and forth and you can hear the fan cut on and off. And here's that quick snip. So as you can see, I had I did have the short. So if you start playing around and you find wiggling the wires don't work, go ahead and take the effort and remove the, the wrapping and unwrap the, uh, the black shielding there and get to the physical wire and move it around itself. Because uh, what we did was, um, here's a picture. We just cut the, uh, the wire and we had an extra servo lead from some uh, drone work and we just spliced it back in uh, just three wires and as you can see we just shrink wrapped it and just buttoned it back up and put the uh, the wrapping back on it um, and again in the video where he describes um, how he fixed it he did 3d print a longer cover uh, or, or kind of a flex point a relief strain relief and I'm thinking about doing that. The only problem is um, we do have this in the um, IKEA enclosure. I have not added the, the plexiglass yet. I still have to buy it and I'm worried if I do add that onto the back I'll run out of room. But anyway I just wanted to kind of give an update that uh, if you're looking around and you wiggle the wires your fan doesn't cut off go a little bit further and check out those wires. Um, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed this quick video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And I appreciate you stopping by to check out uh, future videos. Thanks. Have a great day.